advice I would give with someone who's reading my book who's um, facing um, maybe a negative situation is that, you know, um, you know, you have to first evaluate and assess, you know, the problem that you're face that you're facing, you know, and then, you know, I would try to tell them to establish a game plan, you know, and to take action, you know, because without taking action, without identifying what your conflicts are, without developing a, a, a game plan, you know, these three things are highly important, you know, to um, evolve yourself or to liberate yourself from whatever obstacle you may be facing. And so what I try to do is always utilize what was taught to me on how to solve uh, problems. And I, like I say, through um, Mr. Brown, Jim Brown, the Hall of Fame uh, football player and, and teaching us life skills, these were some of the things that was missing from us. And we was taught in a more negative way on how to deal with issues and conflicts. But when I was taught the proper way of doing it, you know, there's a there's an easy there's a quick quick approach. You know, when you know we taught within our life uh, management skills curriculum, um, and like say for instance, if me and you had a instant situation, first thing we would train ourselves is to eliminate the negative, establish the facts, and choose our best options. But if we take the negative out of it, you know, the options is going to be positive. The fact of the matter is that what happened happened, but as long as we're not, you know, consumed with the negative, we're not reacting in a negative way. You know, maybe he had a bad day. Hey, I don't worry about it. You know, I apologize. Oh, okay. Then the, the options are going to be positive, but there's a a, 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 a a real way to deal with um, real issues that affect you that's maybe systemic, and that have to go to a more deep evaluation. Of, of of the problem that you're facing, which is you have to have full knowledge of your of your situation, because if you don't know, you know what's triggering you. Sometimes people are dealing with, um, you know, child abuse, sexual abuse, and they've been holding this thing for a long time. You know, you have to really, you know, apply. You know, what I'm saying the the, the, the full scope of solving pro solving that issue within yourself in order for you to overcome it. You know, and some people hold on to things too long. And so what we try to do is is trying to give them some scientific way in solving problems because we all are human beings. And um, what I was taught, you know, through the life management skills curriculum is what I applied to myself and I got the best results. And so what I would, you know, kind of do is, is, is if it's fast, I give them a, the quick three steps and... If, if that person needed my advice, I give them the full, you know, full ramification on how you deal with systemic issues that's conflicting you and things like that.